Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carbo Gaming and another Throne and Liberty video. Today we're back at it again. This time we're in the Tyrant Owl taking on Tobleet. I'm going to give you all of the different boss mechanics so you can beat them and get you some sweet loot today. You know what to do. Let's go. Once again, thanks for watching everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's get started. Now, when it comes to the Tyrant Owl, they have some pretty good weapons and armor that you can get. Some considered to be best in slot if you are going for the bow and for the wand. And even the Phantom chest piece if you're looking to complete your set. So let's start off with the boss mechanics for all the different bosses you will encounter. The very first one, this Reptilian Butcher, will be pretty much straightforward. You can interact with this flower over here, so to speak, this coral, and it will stun the boss. You can use this to your advantage to help deal damage to the boss. Then after that, we're going to move on to the next boss. Now, the next boss will only have one devastating attack. He's going to send this, this wave of fire. You can move towards it and jump over, but we actually took the boss out before the actual mechanic. So if it does happen to you, move towards the fire and jump over it. Next up, we have the Bloodthirsty Reptilian. And this guy is going to be pretty easy. You just need to pay attention to one thing. Now, when he says, I'll crush you, he's going to turn red. If you have highlighted red all over you. You need to stand behind one of these fire pits, these little fire tones, there are four of them in total. He'll run toward it and you need to just stand behind it if you highlight it in red so he can stun himself. Watch, rinse, repeat until you take out the boss. Now, when we get to the final boss, let's start off with this. This is probably gonna be the most important thing you need to do. First off, when you get to the final boss, pick a flower. This is gonna be the same flower that you're gonna use to turn yourself back into the human once he turned you into a mouse. So let's talk about the, the mechanic most people are gonna to die to and that's the boss mechanic, but I got you covered. Now, once he says, try to dodge this, once he lifts up his staff in the air, that's when you wanna hit your button to turn into the mouse. Now you can hold the button down, hold the button down until he finishes attack and then come up out of the ground sniff the flower to turn back into the human to deal damage to the boss all right next up he's going to say i'll fry you now when you do that he's going to shoot off this cross filled with fire you can easily dodge out the way it will be close to him so if you run away from him you'd be pretty much good to go run back and deal damage to the boss and also he's going to say try to dodge this now when you do that there's going to be at least two of these little spires that you can stand in they're going to be bubbling up so just stand into the water it's going to knock you into the air and then float back down deal damage to the boss watch and rent repeat those are all the boss mechanics my dude for the rest of this video you're going to be seeing me running this and getting the loot at the end i'll chime in once we do that enjoy we were overhauling the ship the reptilians abducted my entire crew i beg you please rescue them Must die. <laughs> 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 
helped me rescue my crew. Thank you so much. Kaiser is about to erupt! as I was getting.
Get to a tasty ride. So boom, there you have it my dude, full step by step guide so you can beat the tyrant out and get you some sweet loot right here in Throne and Liberty. But for right now, that's pretty much it for the video, I hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you are new to the channel, how you doing and welcome, don't forget to subscribe right here at Carpool Game, upload a wide variety of videos ranging from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support, and as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.